Hello little scientist, welcome to Alan IntelliBrain. In this video, we are going to learn about the process of data representation and its interpretation in a visual format using a bar graph. And we are going to have a lot of fun while learning with an interesting Intelli activity. You will need the following material from your Intelli smart box to perform the activity. Take out the five main plates of the data representation base tray, five pairs of the connector plates, one of them marked as A1, A2, two of them marked as B1, B2, one of them marked as C1, C2, and one of them marked as D1, D2. Six wooden locks, the bar graph activity tag, five category tags, the y-axis stick, the five pairs of data stick parts from the data handling kit, the data blocks and the data handling cards from your Intelli smart box. The data is provided to us in the form of 50 data cards of 50 different famous personalities from five distinct categories on the basis of their fields of work. We are going to represent this data on the data representation base tray using a bar graph. Assemble the data representation base tray as we had done previously in the pictograph activity. After assembling the data representation base tray, we will prepare it for the bar graph activity. Place the bar graph activity tag on the first slit on the front side of the plate 1 such that the slits match and insert a wooden lock in the slit like this. Similarly, fix the 5 category tags using wooden locks in the rest of the front row slits. The data representation base tray is now divided into 5 category wise sections. The categories are scientist, businessman, sportsperson, astronaut, and mathematician. Now, fix the y-axis stick in the slit behind the activity tag on the plate 1. Take two parts of a data stick and fit them together by inserting the central grooves into each other. To make one data stick and like this make four more data sticks. Insert the five data sticks in the five cross slots given along the central part of the base tray. This data representation base tray can be used to represent the data of the five said categories. Let us now collect data from the data cards. Take out all the data cards from the data handling box and shuffle them thoroughly and draw out 40 data cards and keep the rest of the cards aside. These 40 cards is our data in hand. Arrange these 40 data cards into 5 category wise stacks with the picture facing upwards. It's easier to do by matching colors. The red cards are of the category scientist. The blue cards are of the category businessman. The green cards are of the category sports person. The orange cards are of the category astronaut and the yellow cards are of the category mathematician. Let us represent this data in hand using the bar graph. We will use the data blocks to make bars of each category as per the number of cards in each category. The color of data blocks matches with the color of cards of their category. We have 9 cards of the category scientist 10 cards of the category businessman, 
सेवन कार्ड ऑफ द कैटेगरी स्पोर्ट्स पर्सन सिक्स कार्ड ऑफ द कैटेगरी एस्ट्रोनॉट एंड एट कार्ड ऑफ द कैटेगरी मैथमेटिशियन द स्केलिंग ऑफ द डेटा ब्लॉक्स कैन बी डन सच दैट वन डेटा ब्लॉक रिप्रेजेंट वन कार्ड ऑफ अ कैटेगरी Insert nine red data blocks in the data stick in the scientist section for the nine scientist cards. Insert the data blocks such that the shorter side faces you. Insert ten blue data blocks in the data stick in the businessman section for the ten businessman cards. Insert seven green data blocks in the data stick in the sports person section for seven sports person cards. Insert six orange data blocks in the data stick in the astronaut section for six astronaut cards. Insert eight yellow data blocks in the data stick in the mathematician section for the eight mathematician cards. The bar graph represents the data of 40 cards from 5 different categories and it looks splendid. The x axis of the graph is on the base tray which represents 5 categories of the data and the y axis represents the number of famous personalities in each category. We are sure that after performing the activity you will have gained the expertise in the following concepts understanding of a bar graph understanding of data collection scaling required for the bar graph according to the data in hand representation of the data in hand using the bar graph now you can draw out any number of cards from the data handling cards box and represent the data collected using the bar graph Visualize maths with IntelliBrain and fall in love with learning.